Hello and welcome back everyone to Universe Sandbox 2 and there's actually been an update although it's pretty much meaningless and add Okay, I won't be that mean to the team. It's not meaningless. It's meaningless to people who play the game purely for explosions If you're artistic, you'll probably like it so weirdos like Aaron might like it But myself, it's not really my cup of explosions. So for example, we can grab Mars now and we can paint it. We can make it look very nice. Atmosphere color. I can make. I can make Mars have like a custom atmosphere. Oh wow, Mars now has a purple atmosphere. Beautiful. Thank you, Grockle, for subscribing for your sixth month. I think you get a special. I think you get. <laughs> we are autistic and not artistic. <laughs> uh, yeah, pretty much. It doesn't seem to matter if we try to change Mars' uh, interface. Oh, interface color. I see. I think the purple atmosphere looks pretty good on it. But again, the only issue I have with it is it doesn't really change, you know, the explosions. Which, I mean, let's be let's be fair. The entire reason we're playing Universe Sandbox 2 is to throw planets at each other. But we can make some pretty funky, funky combinations. Like, let's go ahead and make Earth, I don't know. Well, what's a very artistic choice? Uh, green atmosphere and... Oh, shoot! Surface colors we can change. Oh, there we go. Okay, so the high colors will make blue. Actually, let's make Earth America. Here we go. We're gonna make the atmosphere color uh, blue. And then we will do red, white red fantastic very nice that totally looks correct there's america and then we've got we'll make this the only logical enemy of america the soviet union so we'll make mars a little like red oh wow this actually kind of looks like the stars fan fanta that's more of china but whatever it's not like we're being historically accurate in the first place. Beautiful. Okay, we've we've got we've got I guess it's China now. We've got China versus the United States. I wonder I wonder what's going to happen. It's not like this is unfair because we've made the United States much larger and awesomer and it's the United States, so it's got I mean, let's I guess it's like comparative military sizes. That that seems that seems like a good way to spin it. Okay, China's incoming with its pimple-looking mountains. It's about to smack into Earth with force of at least a thousand pencils being dropped on the floor. And now we see the beautiful explosion. The reason that we're playing this game in the first place. America's doing pretty well. I think that the collision is actually going to make America more American because now the colors are going to get more intense as the water leaves. Nothing more American than getting super patriotic in the middle of a war. Okay, let's see if that's... The, oh, look at that. The red, white, and blue. They're really coming out now. Look at it. Oh my god. Oh, you have really angered America. This is like... This is this is dangerous. This is very dangerous. You do not want to deal with America in this state. They are about to go freedom on your ass. It's going to be pretty bad. I don't know who who's going to take on America now. I would make jokes, but they would be demonetized and my channel's rankings would be very secretly plummeted by the algorithm, so we're not going to make jokes about any groups that might damage America. Communists! Um, here we go. We're going to... What can take on America at this point? I'm not really sure. I I'm honestly not sure what can beat America at this point. I think the only thing that can beat America is younger America. So we're going to put America up against its younger self. Um, it doesn't even have the coloration yet because they haven't designed the flag. Very sad. Oh, oh, grazing hit. 
America eats itself for breakfast. Oh god. It looks like we're back in the 1700s now. This is unfortunate for a lot of people. <laughs> oh, it vaporized itself. Yikes. Um. Uh. We ended slavery. Great. By vaporizing Earth. And we ended racism by extension. Well, now there's just this white fog hanging out, and I guess this is like the souls of the dead, and they're just kind of chilling. That's neat. I'm a big fan of the souls that are just kind of chill. These are uh, very, very, the angular velocity is very low. They're at 11,000 degrees. This is the soul of racism. We must stamp it out. Okay, how long is it gonna take? It only took a few hours, actually. Wow. Okay, guys, what are we doing next? There's gotta be something exciting we can do other than ending racism and destroying communists. There's, there's more to this game, darn it. There's a galaxy here. Wow. Ooh, ooh, the Whirlpool Galaxy. Nice. Nice. It's about to collide with this galaxy, but not if America has any say. <laughs> what if we fire America into this galaxy and just give it, like, insane mass? Okay. Earth is just America because I'm American and, you know, who cares about the other places? Great. Okay, we're firing America. Uh, let's go to the motion, and it's gonna be have to go uh, pretty quickly, actually. We're gonna fire it at, like, 10, 100 times the speed of light. That seems fair. That seems realistic. We're also gonna give Earth, like, mass equivalent to the Milky Way. Oh, wow. Wow. That really warped my reality. Look at that. Look at that. It's a black hole now. Okay, America. Oh my god, America, you're moving too quickly. Holy guacamole. I thought on the scale of galaxies and the speed of light would not... But I guess it's like, that's that's per second the speed of light. So maybe I just have very small brain. Okay, what we'll do is we'll do negative one light speed to get it go back in the other direction. Yeah, we're going like millions of years per second. So that was just, okay, 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 so. So it's still way too fast. Um, we're gonna do times 0 0.1 a few times. Um, wow. America! Come on, you're supposed to destroy the galaxies. In, because they've got oil. Okay, here we go. Ugh. Okay, here we are. Great. Can we can we destroy this is now a love triangle. America is about to get between M my my favorite my favorite galaxy here. M51A and M51B. But America isn't re oh well, we are kind of getting in the way. M15B M51B is coming towards America a little bit and but not really because these are like way more massive these are like 30 times the weight of the milky way so we're gonna make america eat more that's that's challenging but we can do it okay let's just make it like a hundred times the mass the milky way haha -ha, now these guys are gonna want america this is a rescue mission you are being rescued <laughs> Oh, shoot, never mind. America seems to be the catalyst to make this get much worse. Everything is being spat out at light speed. Oh, boy. Oh, that was quite bad. Yikes. Oh, but America! America retains some of the galactic mass and creates a tiny little galaxy. Oh, beautiful. Absolutely wonderful. American imperialism at full display. Congratulations, you have been rescued. You are now a part of America. Fantastic. Eagle screeches by. I need an editor so they can do this stuff for me. Where are my eagle screeches? Aaron. 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 Anyways, um... 
I guess no Eagle Screech today. That's sad. But what's more American? I don't know. Um, I don't know how many more things I can do before this video becomes kind of a mess of stupidity. It already is, let's be fair, but we must destroy the multiverse. I don't... What, what if we give the sun negative mass? I'm sure that'll be nothing... The density changed. What? Wait a second. Of course, when... What? Did that actually work? Wait a second. Did that actually just work? Everything is being pushed away from the sun. What the heck? Wait a moment. Wait a moment, that can't be right. Negative mass is a thing in this game? What? What? No. 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 Are you kidding me? I've been playing this game this long and I haven't tried to make the mass of something negative? Okay, wait. We, we need to do some tests. Okay, so Earth... Okay, we need to put two things and then we're gonna set... There's... You've gotta be kidding me. Am I the first person who's tried this? Wait, if this Earth has negative mass and this Earth has positive mass... Oh my god! What? What? No way! Are you kidding me? Are you kidding me? This is a thing. Wait a second. And then if I make it negative... Wh what just happened? What? What? <laughs> how, how is that a thing? Wait a second. Wait a second. What? Okay, this... What What if we get the Milky Way and give it a white hole? That doesn't... Okay. Okay, if we make the Milky Way's mass negative... I don't think this is calculated like a normal object, so I don't think it's gonna do... Oh! Oh? Oh, no, actually... Actually... Something strange is happening. Maybe. It looks like it's eating itself. Or maybe it's just spinning, like a spiral galaxy is supposed to. Yeah, looks like it's just spinning. That's kind of disappointing. Okay, wait, but... But where's the center? Center. Where's the center? Excuse me, I don't care about the nebulas. I want the beautiful, fantastic black hole at the center. Well, actually, I could just give one of these nebulas n Okay, you know what? We, we need to, like, do some more testing here. I am, I am very shocked. Very shocked and in awe at the fact that negative mass exists in this game. I may have just broken the universe. I'm kind of used to doing that, but this is kind of cool. This is more of a cool thing. Okay, so let's get Andromeda and Milky Way and make the mass of the Milky Way negative. Like, or Andromeda negative. Uh-huh. What's going to happen now? Is the Milky Way just going to yeet away from it? Or, no, everything in it's going to still get pulled together because all the nebulas are, like, separate. Damn. Okay, so on the scale of galaxies, this can't really be done. However, I'm highly shocked at the fact that the game does not prevent you from adding negative mass. Like, what happens if you add negative mass to Earth when it's orbiting the sun? What the heck? Why did it... <laughs> I guess negative mass means that everything, all the mass that is exerted on it is negative. What the actual heck? Okay, we have to do more testing on this in the future. I've discovered negative mass. Fantastic. Thank you all for watching. Leave a like and subscribe as we break physics. And I'll see you all next time. America has discovered antimatter. Oh, oh, oh. Beautiful.